So we're standing here uh, behind the 14th tee and uh, I've got uh, our professional uh, advisor here, Mr. Fenn. Uh, so just notice the boys teeing off on 14, none of them hitting driver. Uh, those of us of somewhat higher handicappers will be standing here trying to smash a driver and getting into all sorts of trouble. What's the thinking for these guys? Uh, I mean, this is this is blowing, this is blowing straight down the breeze. So um, it's the kind of it's not it, it's not the longest hole. It's about getting your tee shot in the right place. Um, if you hit driver down the middle of this hole, you every chance you're going to run out of space and it's going to go in a ditch or the hazard. So the hence. They're taking irons down here. Just it's just positional play, because they they yeah, hit a good iron. They're still only going to have you know a short a short wedge shot in. And is that it, it, are there any circumstances here in, in, in which um, you know the better player would be um, you know looking to get right down and, and leave themselves a, um, you know a really short short club into the screen? Uh, on this hole, I don't think so. No, because I I don't really think it benefits you hitting driver down here. Um, if you get it too close, I mean, you know, the bunker's a long way out there, but down this breeze, maybe a couple of the guys can get there. If you get too close, you're not really spinning the second shot. You won't have enough control over it. And this being a hole where the flag is, is fairly central does give them an opportunity to, to hit a wedge or short iron in there close. OK. Well, we'll see how these, these guys uh, do up ahead. Joe's found his ball, which is good news. So uh, we'll catch up with them a bit later and we'll be with you in a moment with the, uh, uh, the, the penultimate group who are now coming down the 13th.